Rick, Cam, thank you guys so much for taking the time to do this uh, with us. Uh, we at Dragonfly couldn't be more excited about the partnership that we're now forming up uh, with Enderby. Rick, um, can you maybe just tell me why you think this is an important move for Enderby to be partnering with Dragonfly and what it means for the film industry? With us, you know, monitoring the current situation with the film business, the back to work protocols that are endless with every country and every state, a lot of it comes down to testing and how do we test the crew and the cast on set. So the initial thing, you know, looking at Dragonfly, what it could do, this is the answer that we're all looking for in our business. What is it about this particular uh, system in your mind, uh, as opposed to maybe somebody just having, you know, a thermal gun on set checking temperatures, as opposed to, um, you know, having uh, this type of a system in place at the entrances and, and throughout your sets? I think for us, you know, the more that we can do to have the, to collect the data and to make it kind of a seamless process where people are going to and from set multiple times throughout the day and multiple entry points to the set potentially depending if you're on a sound stage or on location for us to have a, an actual apparatus in the machine like dragonfly has versus someone with a clipboard writing down names it seems to be that the accuracy is uh, far more you know beneficial to us cam as vice president of production at enderby entertainment what is it about this that attracted you to, uh, to have confidence in the fact that, uh, that this is something that will, that will keep your set safe and your people safe. One of the main things is that I know people really want to get back to work, but I also know that they, they might be nervous about getting back to work. And I think that just having this uh, unique extra precaution will make people a lot more comfortable going back to work. And when people are comfortable at work, they work better. <laughs> Rick, you're, you're really deeply involved in this. Uh, this, this seems to be, uh, you know, something that's much more important to you than just making sure, uh, the productions that you're involved with, um, uh, have a safe set solution. You know, what, what's really driving Enderby being deeply involved in a partnership level to help get this out to industry. I think having many conversations with people in our industry and, and following all the back to work mm -hmm. protocols and seeing what people are trying to do it made sense for us to kind of be uh, to partner to be able to take this to our colleagues in the business to say, he here's how we're going above and beyond. And here's how you as a company can go above and beyond, whether it be the unions and the guilds, the distribution companies that are obviously trying to get content and production companies that, you know, have a long slate of productions to go, you know, to, to get back into production like ourselves. Uh, it made sense for us to partner to be the voice to take this to our industry and, and say, here's how we're, making everybody safe, including the actors who are the biggest obstacle right now, whether they want to work or not. Without the actors, you're not making moves. And Cam, uh, in terms of uh, what this means long term, uh, is this the new normal? Is this, is, are things like uh, temperature checks and health safety and health measurement now the new normal uh, for the film industry? It feels like it might be to me. It's tough to put the toothpaste back in the tube, you know, and <laughs> it's, uh, we've, we've, it's it's been quite a scare and it's been and it's opened a lot of people's eyes to how fragile it you know our health is you know and that it, uh, something could come along like this that you know maybe you could say you could have seen it coming maybe you couldn't we don't know and, and so I, I think it probably is going to be the new normal um especially if it's if it's beneficial and i can't see much of a downside to it being the new normal you know, it's just another thing that people are going to have to do, you know, and, and, and I think everybody will get used to it and it'll just be a new protocol. Why do you feel it's important that, you know, uh, you know, somebody who really understands um, product, uh, producing and somebody who really understands uh, production is involved with having designed um, these safe set solutions to, to come to the industry? I mean, I, I get I mean, the, the film industry, as we've come to understand, it's a very unique in terms of, of all the different safety points and you know you know what are some of those most unique things and why do you feel it's important that the actual company from the industry is helping drive this process having the whole industry shut down and everyone's out of work we're all uniting together to figure out how do we go back to work how do we get back into production and you have task force and you have people trying to figure out uh how best to shoot a film and limit the number of crew that you have and the camera departments and i think i think for us is that this is a way for us to present to the industry that uh, an amalgamation globally of filmmakers putting together the guidelines that we need to go back to work. And this is just a tool that 
uh, is maybe the missing element, a faster testing, more accurate, the data that we need, and it basically is a comfort zone to uh, move forward with our production. Well, I know that we're learning a ton and I'm incredibly confident that, uh, that this technology in uh, working in partnership with you so that we are able to, to deliver not just the best tech, but the best solution uh, as, uh, is, is really going to be impactful in the industry. So thanks so, thanks so much for your Thank you, thank you so much. Yeah, thanks for having us again.